Good evening, I'm Christine Johnson and that's shooting terrifying passengers during the afternoon commute today. The NYPD gave us an update just a little more than an hour ago and they told us the shooting happened on an A train at the Hoyt Skirmahorn station in downtown Brooklyn. CBS 2's Lori Bordenero is there now with the very latest for us. Lori. And Christine, police tell us the man who was shot was actually the man who brought the gun onto that train. As you can imagine, some very terrifying moments for passengers this evening. It all unfolded just before 5 o'clock on the northbound A train here at the Hoyt Skimmerhorn Station. Police tell us that a 32-year-old man got into the train at Nostrand Avenue when he was approached by a 36-year-old man acting aggressively. Uh, the two began arguing and then fighting, and police say that 36-year-old first pulled out a knife and then a gun, and that's when the other man grabbed that gun and shot the 36-year-old multiple times. He was taken to the hospital in critical condition. Witnesses tell us they were crying and huddled together. They say police came onto the train with guns drawn, telling everyone to stay down. It's not a right thing to experience this at all because I don't know if I'm paralyzed. I still can't stand up. I have those two people right here helping me, basically. Yes, that's how it is. It's not safe. It's not safe for us. It's very important that it be known there were multiple police officers in this station uh, just feet away from when this train pulled in that actually heard the shots and were on scene within seconds. And the man who fired was taken into custody. It's not clear at this point if he'll be charged or if he was acting in self-defense. We're live in downtown Brooklyn. Lori Bordenero, CBS2 News.